Hello everyone. My name is Nimisha Sarah Verghees. I am a chef at the Obroy Bangalore. Uh, today we're going to be making a dish with beetroot. What we're going to be making today is a roast beetroot carpaccio with um, some goat cheese, walnuts and mesclun leaves. So to start off, we're going to take about five or six beetroots and roast them in the oven at around 200 degrees Celsius for half an hour. To marinate your beetroot, you will take um, a few cloves of garlic, some rosemary, some sea salt and olive oil. We wrap it up in foil and put it in the oven to bake for half an hour. While the beetroot is roasting, you can uh, make your goat cheese mousse. For that, we need around one cup of cream. Ensure you take cooking cream, otherwise it might split on with the heat. About 150 grams of goat cheese, crumbled goat cheese. You heat it up and once the goat cheese melts, once the goat cheese melts, put it aside and leave it in the fridge for about 15 to 20 minutes till it becomes of a thick, nice consistency. Once the beetroot are done, take them out, the, out of the oven, peel them and then you thinly slice them. You want to ensure that they're really thinly sliced because we're going to put quite a few layers of beetroot on the plate. To line the beetroot, you can either use you can use a ring mold or you can directly put it on a plate. But we've just for a little bit of neatness, we've taken a ring mold and we're going to arrange the sliced beetroot neatly inside the mold. The plate would look something like this. Now you take your chilled goat cheese and we're going to shape it into quenelles which can be done to using two spoons of the same size. Just take a little bit of goat cheese and then shape it up with the spoons like this. We've also got a few orange segments just to add a little citrusy feel to the salad. And for a different texture of the beetroot or a different flavor altogether, what we've done, we've taken some of the beetroot and I've cured it in a bit of uh, vinegar. So it's like a pickled beetroot. So we've got the sweet roasted beetroot right here and we've got some of the pickled beetroot as well. For the pickling mixture, you just have to make a mix of salt, uh, sugar, salt and uh, vinegar and a little bit of water and soak the roasted beetroots in that. For the mescaline salad, we're just going to take a few assorted baby lettuce leaves. I've got rucola, a bit of oak leaf lettuce. Red oak and green oak is what I've used. And I've also got some micro herbs. So you can just toss them up with a little bit of olive oil. And if you have a little bit of red wine vinegar. The micro herbs that we've used are a little bit of green pea shoot and um, alpha alpha sprouts. You can then add a few walnuts just to give it a difference in texture. Just crush them and throw them across the plate. And some lovely organic radish that we get, some red radish, place it in the plate. Put some sea salt. and some crushed black pepper. 
just a little bit of olive oil, a drizzle of olive oil around the beetroot and your salad is ready.